Infinity War will see Thanos jam all those Infinity Stones in his Golden Gauntlet, as Earth's mightiest heroes unite to stop him. Lost for millennia, the MCU has seen all but one of the Infinity Stones come into play, but it's a big galaxy, yet so many of these Infinity Stones have wound up on Earth. So what's going on? Before we get into why Earth is so cosmically important, here's a breakdown of the Infinity Stones that turned up on our home planet. Revealed in Doctor Strange, the Time Stone has been on Earth since the days of Agamotto, which was 10,000 years ago. Otherwise known as the Tesseract, this jewel of Odin's treasure room was left on Earth many, many years ago, and we still don't know exactly why this happened. It was returned to Asgard in the Avengers. Remember that scepter that Loki used in the Avengers? This was given to him by Thanos, and after the Avengers defeated Loki, the Mind Stone that powered the scepter later bonded with Vision. In Thor The Dark World, Jane Foster was infused with the Aether, which is really the Reality Stone. It is now kept safe by the Collector. Now, it looks like the Fifth Stone will be discovered in Wakanda. Infinity War footage unveiled at D23 showed Thanos sending his Black Order to Wakanda, and there's only one reason for him to do that, because the Soul Stone is there. That's way too many Infinity Stones in one place to be a coincidence, so why are they all drawn to our world? As the comics recently revealed, the stones aren't drawn to Earth specifically, but to each other. In New Avengers, a criminal known as the Hood discovered that bearing an Infinity Gem gave him an heightened awareness of where the others were. He was guided by the power of the gems, as the semi-sentient rocks longed to be together again. If the Infinity Stones are drawn to each other in the same way in the MCU, then it would make sense that all of them wound up on Earth. This probably started with the Time Stone being hidden on our world. Earth was the perfect hiding place, at the time, we were nothing more than a cosmic backwater populated by primitive species. No one would think to look for an Infinity Stone here. Because humans hadn't yet achieved spaceflight, the Time Stone was stuck on Earth, but it drew the other stones to it like a magnet. The Tesseract was somehow stranded on Earth, and portals let the Aether to be brought to our world during the Convergence in Thor The Dark World. If the Soul Stone pops up in Black Panther, we can assume it was brought here by the meteorite that also gifted Wakanda with vibranium. Not only does this explain the importance of Earth, it also suggests why Thanos gave the Mind Stone to Loki. This has always troubled Marvel fans. If Thanos was seeking out the stones, why would he give his only one to Loki? But maybe this was all part of his plan, as Loki could use the Mind Stone's guidance to find the Tesseract. Fans have long wondered about the strange coincidence that caused so many Infinity Stones to wind up on Earth. Now we know that this is no coincidence at all, but an effort by the stones to find each other again. So keep your eyes peeled for that Soul Stone in Black Panther, because we're pretty sure it'll also pop up on Earth, just in time for Infinity War.